It is not always the case that a work of fiction and its film adaptation are both considered masterpieces by critics and audiences alike. One of the rare examples is Marketa Lazarová, a historical novel by the multi-talented Vladislav Vančura, published in 1931 and later turned into a black-and-white film classic. A medical doctor by original profession, Vladislav Vančura pursued his passion for writing to become an acclaimed novelist, playwright, film director and screenwriter, known for his fine prose and distinctive literary style. Marketa Lazarova is set in medieval Bohemia, torn by clashes between clans of highwaymen and the crown, between Christianity and paganism. At the centre of the novel is a dark love story. Marketa, the daughter of Lazar, destined to spend her life in a convent, is abducted by a member of a neighbouring clan. And although she was never meant to know the love of a man, she discovers her sensual self in that relationship. The book is full of cruelty, filth and violence, yet there is poetic beauty in its rawness. And Marketa Lazarová ranks among the classic works of interwar Czech modernism. The novel was adapted into the eponymous film by František Vláčil in 1967, which is widely considered to be one of the best Czech films ever made. The black and white epic preserves the intoxicating atmosphere of the original, as well as the author's distinctive language. Vladislav Vančura was forced to abandon his last book in mid-sentence. For his activities in the resistance during the Second World War, he was executed by the Nazis in 1942 in Prague, in the prime of his life and at the height of his creative powers. <laughs>